Hi, it's Elvir. Thanks for tuning in. I wanted to talk to you this morning a little bit about pain. We all suffer from pain. We have it either constantly or we have it from time to time or we get it from time to time. And one of the easiest things that we do is just get a painkiller, right? We just take a pill or whatever it is, we get a painkiller. What I have learned, and it took me quite some time to truly accept this, is embrace the pain, accept the pain, welcome the pain. You see, pain is an indication that something is amiss in the body, in the mind, because your body is an expression of what goes on in your mind. So the pain of your emotions, the pain of your mind needs to be expressed in some way in the body. And in her beautiful book, Heal Your Body, this one by Louise Hay, which is based on 2,500 years of Chinese medicine, she explains all the pains and diseases that we may have. And it's absolutely amazing. It's also amazing to see how many of these, and I'm just trying to flip up the page here. If you look at this, maybe you can see, you see the pink and the orange. I have highlighted how many of the pains, diseases, ailments in the body we have coming from fear. Remember, we only have two fears, right? We only have two fears, the fear of falling and the fear of loud noises. That's what it's supposed to be. But over long time now, we have created more and more fears. We live in a fear based society and you can see it with all the let me protect you be careful here and all these securities that are installed to protect you fear-based so fear is a normal way of living it's not because fear creates adrenaline rush you know, when you have to, to, to run for a disabled tooth tiger like our ancestors did. And you and I, you know, we're so lucky that our ancestors survived the disabled tooth tiger. But what happens is the adrenaline is created in your body to push you into action, to stop certain processes in your body and to give you energy just to, to run away. That is good. Adrenaline is good but not 24 hours, seven days a week, 365 days a year. Your body cannot handle it. So the fear is horrendous. Read this little booklet, $6.95. You can't go wrong on that one. Anger is another pain. It's expressed in pain. So many pains are based on anger. What are you so angry about? Well, there are many, many ways to translate why you're angry. And I don't want to go into this one right now. I will talk about that in another way, in another video about anger. But here's the thing, what I want to tell you, you have pain, it's an alarm system. It's like the alarm goes off. So wake up, become aware of your pain is an indication that something is amiss. Welcome it and say like, thank you for this pain. I know I need to do something. I know I need to look somewhere in me mentally and figure out what is not working that is expressing itself through my body. This may be all new for you, but I would like for you to ponder on it. None of this is my invention. This is what I have learned and I'm embracing everything of it because it harmonizes with me totally. It is the total truth. Taking pills, taking painkillers is insanity. It's taken the, the, the capabilities of who you are, of your bodily function, it's taken it away. Embrace it. Don't numb it. Don't numb the pain. It's ridiculous. There is one exception, of course. <laughs> when you break a bone or when you have a tooth pulled or when you need to have a surgery, it's a bit of a different ball game. But you know very well what I mean. The regular pains in your body, your back pain, your, 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 your pain in your muscles, your headache, all of that are indications that something is amiss. Go play with it a little bit. Get yourself the booklet. Hey, leave me some feedback. I would really, really, really appreciate that. Leave me some feedback. And if you want to talk with me, grab the telephone. I would love to talk with you or send me an email. I'm here. That's my real email. That's my real, real telephone number. Hey, thanks for tuning in. Have a very beautiful day.